Hi. So for today's video, I just want to show you guys my bucket hat collection here. Since it's starting summer, so I just want to quickly just show my little collection. Mm -hmm. Here you go. Here you go. Get a glimpse. Get a glimpse. It's not a lot of color because I prefer my bucket hats to be neutral, not swallowing my entire outfit. So I'm going to start with this one. It's a vintage um, bucket hat from, I believe, 1997. Yeah, because it has this stitching, so it's 1997, and it says 100% vinyl. There's, yeah, there we go. This is vinyl. Can you see? Vinyl. Yeah, it's pretty cool. So the only reason I like this is it's very different than what bucket hats we have right now. Well, we have in our contemporary fashion at this point. It's The tip is very bold. It's very bowl cut, unlike the ones that we have now. It's almost a fedora. So I'm gonna give this a try. Just put it on to you guys. It's cute. It looks good on a curtain haircut. Because I've never got to wear my bucket hat because for a long time I never had a haircut. If you want to see that, there's the other video I uploaded. This one. Next one I got on Shein. My bro people right there. Hello, what's up? Nice meeting you again. I got this for four dollars, I think, which is not bad. Cause every time I would buy uh, on Shein, I would just buy an entire outfit or like mm, occasionally, like my old haul videos, I would just buy some few accessories if I do have some stuff lying around. If I do have a lot of clothes now, so I'll just buy a few accessories. This one I got with an outfit. Then I recently paid for four bucks on this, and then I got a discount, three eighty five. I got it for three dollars and eighty five cents. It's really cute. I like the color. It says NYC. The only reason I got it is like it looks vintage because you, you never see this kind of cute stuff anymore. The thrift store that not like it used to be because everybody keeps on buying there. It's kind of like come on, leave the cute stuff for other people too. This one I also got on Shein. It's actually a pack of two. It came with this for free, but let's show you this one first. This one is for, I think, for, for, for. Oh, this, oh no, it didn't came with this. this. Okay, this, let's talk about it later. But this, I got this alone on its own. I think I paid four dollars and, or four dollars or five dollars. Pretty much four dollars because I never spent much even though i like this really good looking fluffy cow bucket hat on shein but like i just never like justify paying six dollars for a bucket hat so this one is four dollars probably it's really cool i like the rings right here look at that four dollars there you go four bucks it looks cute looks sick it's affordable who wouldn't want it the reason the only Thing I like about it as well it covers me up from the Sun it's almost like a beach hat but like not a lot of people like to put this in bucket hat some people like put it on top like that I personally prefer it down also as well it depends occasionally I like it on top if I am like I want to show my brand new haircut then my roots are you know not matching with my natural and then my, like my actual hair on the bottom so I just like sometimes do this but if i just want to cover up from the sun i can just pull it down so yeah next i got this really cool one the reason i got it is i'm obsessed with um um east asian um writings and you know because i love korean hello i love korea I love k-pop and it says it says in hango i don't know how to read um korean hango and it has almost the Korean flag in here. So I have to get it. I just have to. And it's only four bucks. Is it? I mean, also I said cuss words, so I am like living for that. I love how the graphic it looks. I think it's on Shein. Although I think I got it on Yesta, but I never go on Yesta because the shipping is pretty high and Shein you can get free ship. Um get the shipping and then I just have more trust on Shein because on yes, that was kind of sketchy. I gotta lie. So yeah, I like this. It says I hate you. I don't like that word, but I love I love the graphics and everything. Totally killed it. Next item. Next item. 
This one I got on buy one and take one. Now my hair is getting messy. Okay, now that's good. That's good. Split. This one I got buy one take one. This one is not a cheetah print. Uh, it's not a cow print. It's a cheetah print. I got that mixed up. Yeah, it's it's cheetah print. It's like more splattered, more small, and more like that. But when I got it, I, I just like to believe it's cow print. Also made myself believe it's cow print. <laughs> oh my god, I had to crack my neck there. It's pretty cute. Almost goes with an outfit. Black and white, black and white, black and white. Then more, just more black on the hat. I like it. I, I, I occasionally want to get the other one, which is like a fluffy and actually cow, not cheetah. But I just couldn't spend $6 and I wouldn't, you know, able to use it on summer because that would be pretty hot, let's be honest. And fur collects a lot of dust. And you know, no, no, no. I just store my bucket hats in a container and I don't want them to be ruined. Plus they're cheap. I should have just gotten, but anyways, this is for free. And it says no idea. I don't know. Every time I wear this, people just look at me. I like it as well. I like it. It's like an invisibility cloak. It's really, it covers me up. It's a visibility cloak from other people. It's a, I like it. That's why I get credit haircut because I don't like staring at people. I get double, I, I got cross. Sometimes I cross eye with the camera as well. Or like when I look at other people, I like look at there. I don't stare at them. So I just felt awkward. So I like to get, I got a curtain haircut and a bucket hat. So I don't do that anymore. So next, next is my very first bucket hat to be honest. The reason I just got him because I'm a hoarder and on H&M is having a sale. So I just like, I want that. I, I got it with a bag as well, because I'm a hoarder. I don't need any more bags. I just added those. It's like earrings some of my mom got and she and that she lost the other pair. I was like, oh, I can make something out of that. And she, she, she threw it on the trash already, but I just have to get it. And I added this, because I'm artsy. It's very extra. This bucket hat is so used. The reason is like, when I first had it, I would like roll it up like this because of a fedora. Everybody was like, oh, what are you wearing a fedora for? And I'm like, <laughs> it's a bucket hat, but I just don't like, because when I used to have like really like long hair, like all like right up to here, it's like very awkward to wear a bucket hat because it just like bulge up so much up in here. It's ugly. So yeah, I added some clips and like a, additional chain right there another another safety pin a little chili i mean i could have just gotten up with the chain not with the chili but like i just want to add a pop color so now that's my bucket hat collection thank you guys for watching this video and stay tuned or watch my other videos